right, Roger, many congratulations. A seventh Miami semi-final awaits. And I've got to say, a lot of lesser players would probably have given up after your incredible first set performance, but Kevin's such a fighter, isn't he? No, he's a great fighter. Look, he's a true professional. Um, regardless of the score, he's going to keep going for it and keep believing. Uh, you know, in tennis, uh, you got to cross the finish line. You can't wait for the clock to run down. And he did just that. He came out swinging and uh, he got me, you know. So he broke me back with, I think, four clean winners and then had a great game after that. And, you know, it gets you thinking. So it was, uh, it was difficult, but uh, I had a tough game there at 4 all to break. Needed a few break points to come through. And uh, that was definitely a relief to make it in two after that great first set. I mean, he may be on the comeback trail from injury, but he's still in possession of a very, very impressive serve, isn't yeah. he? And what's the key to getting so many looks in that serve? You had a lot of break points out there tonight. I thought conditions were a little bit slower tonight. I'm not sure if that's an advantage because sometimes when it's faster, you know, that also gives him less time um, from the baseline. Now, I don't know. I think these are really great conditions, you know, to get the ball back. I already saw it last night with the guys playing. A lot of balls are coming back after a good serve. So from that standpoint, I think it's quite a, an interesting court how he plays at day and at night. And this one was my first night match. So um, I think I got a great look. I mean, the lights are great, you know. Um, they're not always this clear. So I think we're very happy that, uh, that conditions are as good as they are here in Miami at the, at the stadium. And um, yeah, and I think uh, you can wake him up at 3 in the morning. He'll always serve great. But today I had a good returning day, which was great. And you won't thank me for reminding you, but when you started your pro career in 98, Denis Shapovalov wasn't even born. You're facing another one of these young guys tomorrow. What are your thoughts on that match? He's an exciting talent, isn't he? Uh, he's a great talent, uh, Dennis. I like him a lot. He's a great shot maker. Nice guy on top of it, too. And uh, I'm really happy for him and also for Felix to making such a run here in Miami. And uh, can't wait to play against him. I've practiced with him some. And I've been highly impressed. And of course, you know, I saw his match against Rafa that where he crushed foreign after foreign winner uh, down the line. That was impressive. So he's got another run going here. It's going to be hard to stop him. Thanks, mate.